Well, many of us have heard about No Shave November, mm -hmm. right? It's when a man grows out his facial hair to raise awareness and money for charity. That's right. One local police department, though, took part this year, but then they decided to keep it going for a little while longer. Their effort, not just keeping them warm, but also the community they serve. NBC 10 Sam Reed shows us something good. Right off of Broad Street in Stonington, Connecticut. There's cop cars coming and going as police patrol the area. We get called for everything. The range of calls that we go on, it, it never ends. For the last few years, Sergeant Teresa Hirsch says the Stonington Police Department has been participating in No Shave November, raising money for the Connecticut Cancer Foundation. This year, they raised about $2,300. This is a department that truly partners with their community. So it was no surprise when the next month came up and they decided on Double Down December. And then January happened. And this year, an officer was like, is there a way you think that we can extend it? And I'm like, like how? He's like, maybe we can come up with a donation for a different cause now. Nearly seven year patrolman, Officer Peter Siscavage says a beard is his personal preference. I got, you know, you got to shampoo it and I, I keep it conditioned and all that stuff. Like I enjoy doing it. And since other members of the department like theirs too, and they all know there's a lot of people struggling in Stonington, Pete proposed a plan. The price of heating fuel has gone through the roof. Um, People are struggling, um, so we were like, let's let's try to help people out. With a personal donation from his local lawn care business of $1,000, other members of the department donated as well. The idea was to raise money for um, heating assistance in the town of Stonington. And in a few weeks' time, more than $1,700 has been raised for Stonington's Human Services. The organization will distribute the funds as they feel necessary. It feels good to be able to help people out. They're calling their efforts. Warm places thanks to warm faces. Anybody could be put in that position at any time in their life, um, and this just gives us a really great chance to give back. The community can also chip in. The link to donate will stay live for a few more weeks. All involved say they're happy their beards, which keep them warm in the winter, will do the same for others. Well, hopefully it'll help them uh, be a little bit more at ease um, to provide for their families. All their essential things like food and clothes and um, things like that instead of worrying about uh, putting oil in the tank or paying for uh, home heating oil. Showing you something good. I'm Sam Reed.